Hello there, good evening and welcome to what is going to be a very exciting hour ahead of us here on QVC. When it comes to technology, this name is an icon the world over. Renowned over the years and in more recent times for creating and developing groundbreaking technology. It is technology featuring Apple here on QVC between now and nine tonight. It is a jam-packed show. And Lucy Hedges, who lives and breathes technology, oh, <laughs> yeah. you just, <laughs> is here. What do you love about Apple? If you could condense it to a sentence. A sentence? What I love about Good Apple, luck. brilliant design, amazing following, and stays true to what's on what, what it does on, does what it says on the tin basically yeah, yeah. yeah I agree as me. well and I was first introduced to Apple around 95 96 many years ago and my then manager said to me because I asked him why do we love Apple so much he said firstly looks amazing and it is so reliable it performs let's see what's on the way over the course of the hour it is a brand used both professionally and domestically have a look at this it is gorgeous it is the Mac Book Air. It is the Apple MacBook Air 11 inch Intel Core i5 laptop with 2 gig of RAM and 64 gig of flash storage. And being flash static storage can bring a real advantage to this. We have those easy payments for the first time of £283 and the PMP is included, delivered a matter of days to you for you to experience the world of Apple. Coming up a bit later, it is breathtaking and it is aluminium construction from a solid block down here. We'll talk more as the show moves on with Lucy. And of course, we'd love your feedback on Apple, your experiences. Do you text us, do you phone us on 0800 54 44 34 to phone through. Our next preview is this here. And we will dedicate time during the show to each of these fabulous products. This is just highlighting what is on the way. Now, 502132, the Apple iPod Nano 16 gig MP3 player with FM radio here on QVC, £129 the price. Blue, graphite, green, orange, pink and silver are your colour choices. It's a photo viewer. It is an FM radio. It's going to play your music as well. It is stunning, it is very portable, and an incredible price as well. 502132 is your item number there. So lots to see and feature in this hour, including the iPhone, which I'll show in a few moments. But our next preview is this, the iMac. Really want it. <laughs> really, really want this. 502121, I think I said that on the last show and I still want it. It is the Apple iMac 21 and a half inch all-in-one 2.7 gig Intel quad-core i5 with 4 gig of RAM, super fast, incredibly powerful, 1,000 gig of storage. Again, PMP is included here. There's your QVC price. Those three easy payments of £416 and 34 pence. Switch this off and you still want one. It is beautiful to look at. Look at the keyboard. Look at the mouse. Wireless technology. 502121 is your item number. That is coming up a little bit later here on our hour of technology featuring Apple. Now, here is the phone which continues to take the world by storm. Have a look at this. It is SIM free as well. Important to point that out. The Apple iPhone 4, SIM free smartphone with accessory pack here as well. You've got those interest easy payments of £153 in here. I'm going to check my email. Actually, I've changed my mind. I'm going to browse some photos instead, or perhaps I'll just make a phone call to QVC instead to order my iMac. This is coming up a little bit later. Phenomenally successful in the past. Black or white being the colour choices. There's the frame on the outside. That acts as the antenna. <laughs> it is just brimming with features and it's beautiful. It is just beautiful. And the white, which my other half has and loves, is now limited stock. We're down to the last 10 cents already on the white option of the iPhone. Five megapixel camera, 
You've got the front and rear camera there, of course, as well. Eight gig of storage, stainless steel frame, which acts as the antenna, as I mentioned. Uh, Retina display, it is as good as the display gets right now with the iPhone. 502243 and those interest for easy payments as well. The flip case is included. £153, your first payment there. I have been a big fan of Apple for many, many years, and I'm both a PC and Apple user, but I was introduced to Apple around 95, 96, and this is how much faith the company I worked for had in Apple. We were producing the Brits, mm -hmm. the radio show for Radio 1, yep. which was live, and I was editing uh, interviews with the likes of Oasis and Blur. We played them out live from an Apple computer for the show. That is how much trust and faith I've always had in Apple because it is re reliable, it does work, it does perform and it looks rather gorgeous as well. The MacBook Air is coming up later but we are starting the show with this here. 502127, it is the iPad 2, 16 gig of storage with Wi-Fi and front and rear cameras, £329 the price and those maximum easy payments there for you as well of £82.25p. So the first payment today, no delivery charge on that first payment. This is delivered in a matter of days to you. This is the tablet which has set the world alight, isn't it, Lucy? Yes, this is probably the most talked about rectangle on the planet. <laughs> I think you're right. And your story, what you just told, sums up pretty much what Apple's all about. They're at the forefront of what's hot right now. And I think a lot of people are under the misconception that Apple spawned this new breed mm. of portable device, but no, they didn't. Mm. Portable devices of touchscreens have been around for ages, but what Apple's done is packaged it in a gorgeous, you know, aluminium case. It's thin, it's lightweight. It, yeah. You know, it pit it's the epitome of portability. But on top of that, it's incredibly intuitive. So you've got a touchscreen that you can just swipe mm. through. It's really, really obvious to the point where if you Google toddler iPad, you'll be able to see a video of a two year old scrolling their way through more so than my parents but you know it's just usable by anyone it's really easy to use and that's what this tablet's all about and that's why it's so exciting it really is incredibly exciting i have an ipad members of my family have ipads as well colleagues here at qvc have ipads it performs it works it does so much for you and this is what we have on offer. It is the white option on those maximum easy payments, £82.25, the first payments, and this is with you in a matter of days. Let's go through the specification. It is the iPad 2, 16 gig of storage, Wi-Fi, front and rear camera. What is on board? When I get this home, when I switch this on, when I set this up, which is very easy to do, as mm -hmm. I found out from personal experience, yes. What can I do with this? Let's go back to the beginning for those who've heard about this but aren't really that familiar what we can do with Absolutely. this. Absolutely. Okay, so you're taking it out of the box. What you're going to get, you're going to get dual cameras. So you've got HD video straight out of the box. You've got a camera at the front, which is fantastic. You've also got your iPod. So it's a built-in iPod as well. In fact, think of the tablet as your multimedia uh, hub. So you can download your music, you can download videos, you can do all this via the App Store. So if we go to the App Store that's here, and I'm sure anyone who's, unless you've been living under a rock, has heard of the <laughs> Apple yes. App Store and the phrase, there's an app for that. Whether you want weather, whether you want fitness applications, whether mm. you want something to do with fashion, there's lots of shopping applications, the App Store has your back. And we're looking at over half a million applications in the App Store. Many of which are free, 60, some many of the better of which ones are free. we paid for. Exactly. If you want a bit more better quality, you do have to um, pay up, but yeah. we're not talking 10, 15 pounds, we're talking 199, 299. It's not a great deal of money compared to what you're paying if you had a console when you wanted to buy computer games. So out the box, yeah. this is a music player, it's a video player, it is a handheld gamer because you can download games from the App Store. It's a it's almost like a Kindle. Obviously, it's not a Kindle because that's Amazon's product, but you can read books, you can read ebooks yes. on this as well. So if we go to ebooks here, you show us an ebook. Can I just mention that already around a hundred orders confirmed on this incredible piece of technology? The build quality, as we know with Apple, is superb. It is user friendly. It is intuitive. The touch screen is so responsive. I mean, look at that. Really, really light. Yeah. Really light. Um, swipes there and that's what's so great about it and on top of that 
it's got some other intuitive features that a lot of people okay. just aren't really aware of. So here we have the home button at the bottom. Now I'm going through different apps, I'm flitting in and out of them. Yes. If I want to flit in and out of them quickly, we do something called multitasking. So if I double tap this home button at the bottom, up pops a row of everything that I've been using and I can flit in and out of those accordingly. So mm. there I am on iTunes, now here I am in video. See how quick those transitions are, the QVC application. Back to my uh, music player. It's all, it's all very quick, all very swift. Now if you're playing music, I can hit a track there. If I turn up, listen to that speaker. I've got a speaker. Little speaker grill at the bottom, yeah. non too intrusive, it doesn't stick out. It sits very flush with the iPad. It just looks really, really good. Sounds good, but it also has a 3.5 millimeter headphone jack if need be. It is all about being portable. It is all about being really functional as well. It is the iPad 2 from Apple, from QVC, with those four easy payments. My son was really poorly last night, got home at about one in the morning. He was feeling quite unwell, so I sat in his bedroom on the floor with the iPad. I was browsing YouTube. You can spend hours on YouTube. I was watching some catch-up catch TV on the BBC iPlayer. I could check my emails as well. And when I'm at work with my iPad, if I bring it here, with me, I can FaceTime my family, which is video conferencing, video chat over the internet. There is so much you can do. It is proving to be a very busy hour. And FaceTime is brilliant because it's not only that you can use it with your iPad. If yeah. you're one of you know, if you're an Apple fanboy, which is someone who you know buys into the every single Apple product, you can then. Um, spread this experience across different handsets. So I'm going to give you an example of that. So I'm going to take a photo of you. Yes. And we'll come back to this later, but I'm going to take okay. a photo of you using the rear snapper. <laughs> now, the good thing is you can delete them. <laughs> yeah. If you don't like the photo, you can delete it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm always doing that. Oh, delete, delete again, again. <laughs> yes. But what Apple has come out with, with the latest version of its um, operating system, which is iOS 5. Yeah. I'll just let everyone else out there know iOS 6 is on the way, so we will get an upgrade soon, but it's still fantastic. And with this, we've had the introduction of something called iCloud. So back to what I was saying about having multiple Apple devices, you can share content between devices, but really easily. There's no connecting. It's all done over yes. a wireless network. Work. So I've taken that photo and we've got sim uh, multiple um, Apple products, so we'll get back to that later. We'll touch on that on, on another product. Uh, look what I've just found on there as well. I've never looked better. <laughs> <laughs> I quite like the thermal camera. That's Photo Booth, a really fun app, just to inject a yeah. bit of fun into taking photos. It's, it's amazing. It's, and you can take that. photos, you can email them to your friends, maybe upload them when you're on a Wi-Fi network. Things will then get sent to your other devices. It's just a way to have fun. Inject now, you can argue a smaller version of this, which makes phone calls, is the iPhone 4. Yes. And that is what we have in this show as well. However, a lot of orders already from preview. The white has sold out. Wow. The black is is available and as I say I can send and receive an email when I've got that wireless connection I guess it's 3G as well though isn't it it is yes brilliant limited stock on the black or perhaps I want to go to YouTube I can look at my photos if I want to and just look at that photo after photo turn it this way and it turns around for me as well I'm not That's sure who these photos are oh they're you <laughs> OK, See, but I'm not sure Don't anymore. ask me how I'm they sure ended up on, on there, but, you know, that's the beauty that of iCloud. That was a late iCloud. night out. That's the beauty of it. It was a late <laughs> night out, yes. <laughs> <laughs> We're limited stock on the phone. Easy payments of £153. My other half stayed with a certain brand of mobile for years and for years and for years and for years. The contract came up for renewal and I said, go for the iPhone. I don't know, it's touch screen. I've never had touch screen before. Now, can't put it down. Exactly, and I bet she types really <laughs> fast as well. Oh, emails, <laughs> FaceTime, not that she wants to FaceTime me that often. <laughs> uh, YouTube, draw some, the app oh, loves as well. That is anyway, a firm favourite, uh, isn't it? Be quick for the phone. Be quick for the phone. Back to this in the meantime, 16 gig of storage, mm -hmm. uh, Wi-Fi, front and rear camera. You've yes. got the headphone port that you showed us as well, built-in speaker that we heard, a microphone as well, and fingerprint resistant with some of the latest screen technology and 720p high-definition video recording as well. So you can take photos, you can make videos with this. You've got the FaceTime call facility also. You can visit YouTube, the BBC iPlayer, email, iTunes, the App Store. <laughs> The list goes on, doesn't exactly. it? Exactly, it is endless. Wait for Ooh. us! Bob the Builder interrupting us. <laughs> Just going to play a video. <laughs> but, you know, it's a great device that, say, you're in a family, you've got a family, and this is your, this is mum and dad's device. Yeah. It's a great device to 
for a use of a better word, shut the kids up. <laughs> Keep them quiet. There's so many educational games. Yes. Look, we've got Bob the Builder. You can download um, lots of educational and uh, fun videos and cartoons, that kind of thing. So it's just an all-round device. Mm. And what I personally like, I use this on, my da on a daily basis on the way to work. So I'll be typing um, documents. Yeah. Now, obviously, this isn't going to replace my PC or my laptop. But it will but assist But the, the keyboard is actually quite comfortable. So this is notebook. If I want to start typing, I can do it with one hand. Yeah. Or if I maybe turn it into landscape mode, I can do two-handed. It's just really clever, really intuitive. Now, I test out a lot of tablets, and I'm not going to name names, but a lot of the keyboards are quite poor, if I'm being honest. If you type in quite quickly, like me, and you look... I, I look down when I type as well, and then look up and see what I've written. Yeah. I find that a lot of letters have been missed. You know, you've had hit the space. You thought you've hit the space bar. You've actually hit the letter N. Whereas with the iPad, there's little room for error. It's I also so, find with so the smooth. iPad and with Apple, they keep it really simple. The technology exactly. is so advanced. It is so forward thinking. It is a brand. It is a machine that inspires so many other manufacturers. But the trick, I think, that they've ticked the box on time and time again is that they keep it simple. It is so intuitive, so user-friendly, and a big chunk of the stock has gone. In fact, around a third of the stock has now gone in the early part of this show. 82.25. That is your first easy payment. There is no separate delivery charge. So for 82.25, this rather stunning piece of technology that has taken the world by storm is with you in a matter of days. And as you probably know, if you're familiar with QBC and have been for many years, we always have a 30-day money-back guarantee. That applies to everything here, whether it be food, fashion, technology, beauty or jewellery, there is always a 30-day money-back guarantee. We want you to be happy with every purchase. I think you're going to be thrilled with this. By the way, we have some sellout news for you already. The iPhone 4 has gone. It is a very <laughs> busy show. It's an amazing day here at QVC and an amazing hour of technology. Technology that we can trust, technology that we can rely on, isn't it's it? That, you can definitely rely on Apple. I think testament to the iPad. I work for Stuff Magazine. This is number one in our tablet's top ten, and it has been for a very, very, very long time mm. because it simply is the best tablet. Many manufacturers have come along and tried to beat it, tried yeah. to surpass it, and no one's done it. Apple were just really at the forefront of what makes an incredible product, and the iPad is testament to that. I can't, ex I can't stress enough just how seamless yeah. and how easy to use it is the double tapping, the multitasking, yes. and when you know to save battery life. When you want to save battery life, you can close down certain things that are open because what you little do people know, these things are constantly running in the background. Um, if, you're, if you're using quite relatively light use, maybe quite a medium to heavy use, you're looking at around mm. seven to eight hours of use. This is going to last yes. you the whole day. I can't pick a favourite app. I can't pick a favourite feature on my iPad because <laughs> everything about it I just love. It powers up in next to no time at all. And when we're yes. not using this, do we just put it into sleep mode? What do we mean by that? When you put it into sleep mode, it means it's not fully powering down. Yeah. So it's just a simple case of there's a, the, the wake and home button up here. If I hit that, yes. it turns off. If I press it again, it turns back on. I then swipe and it turns on. And so when it pours, that was sleep mode, but it comes back on very quickly, doesn't exactly. it? Exactly. And See, what's the first thing, Lucy, I should do with this? When I get it home, I get that box, lift off the lid. <laughs> there isn't a manual this suit, by the way. You may be thinking, no. where's that big instruction and that's manual? That's what I love. <laughs> it's so easy. Uh, what's the first thing I need to do? Well, the first thing. Have a little fondle, go through the pages, you know, <laughs> yes. just familiarise yourself with just how beautiful the interface is. But maybe visit the App Store, start um, populating it with applications, maybe get some videos, but there's not anything that you need to do. Mm. It's there for you, everything is set up, the, um, your iTunes, your iPad, iPod even, your App Store, all those features are already there. You don't need to go anywhere and bring them yeah. in. So, technically, unlike a lot of PCs, unlike a lot of laptops, out of the box, this is good to go. It's just up to you how you tailor your iPad experience. £82.25 is your first easy payment. There is no separate delivery charge for £82.25 that first payment's with you in a matter of days. What about travelling? If I go overseas, questions coming through asking if this yes. will work for me over abroad. I'm guessing if you have an internet connection, 
it will. It's fine, exactly. I use my iPad abroad all the time. I'm lucky enough to get to travel with work and I'm yeah. working on my iPad. But, you know, if I want to send something to someone, I can. If I want to send it to a printer, I can. If I want to store it in the cloud, which is online service, so I'm not using um, the the memory on my iPad, I can do mm. so. I can do all those things. Your performance isn't altered or changed in any way if you're going abroad. Yeah. It's the same. And will this iPad 2 work with iCloud? It will work with iCloud. So if I download a music track from iTunes on here, mm -hmm. it will appear automatically on my other iCloud-enabled exactly. devices. Exactly. Yep, and it's Gosh. not just that. It works with applications, it works with music, it works with videos, it works with photographs, it works with documents, but only with specific programs. You can't just fire up any program, write a document and expect iCloud to take that. Apple needs to have it signed on. Yeah. In, in, in its inner circle and then it will it will work its magic and it's a really clever feature for someone who's working on the move and maybe has a central hub at home it's great to take some photos on the move or maybe work on the move and have that all waiting for you when you get home as long as your computer's um, connected to a Wi-Fi network it will do all the work for you it is astonishing it is an incredible piece of technology it is Apple the iPad 2 16 gig with Wi-Fi you've got the front and back camera with video recording and digital stills function up to 10 hours of surfing web on Wi-Fi that's a long time watching video or listening to music I warn you though YouTube is incredibly <laughs> addictive. <laughs> Some of the clips I found in there, which are hysterical and also can be very educational as well. You yes. may have heard of Charlie Bit My Finger Again, which has had oh, something yes. ridiculous like 140 million views. Million, yeah. He's, it's a, he's an internet superstar, those kids. That wasn't this Charlie, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> But these YouTube clips crop up time and time again. In fact, there are TV shows dedicated to YouTube clips. It may be the top 100 or the top 50. You can find those YouTube clips on here with your iPad via the internet. But also you can do fun, zany things. You can send an email. You can receive an email. You can respond to that. And that virtual keyboard appears on the screen. We have it in portrait mode right now, but we can turn it and use it landscape, can't yeah, exactly. we? Which, of and course, is what we'll do quickly. when we're watching maybe the BBC iPlayer. And look how quickly the built-in accelerometer switches that orientation. Yes. There's no lag. It's very quick. And this is just this is this is a theme that continues throughout the entire iPad. You saw yeah. earlier when I was multitasking, just to show you again in case anyone's missed it. Yes. Home button here, I double tap that. I can flip in and out of different applications incredibly quickly. There's no lag, there's no nothing. It's brilliant. It just works. It just works, <laughs> yeah. And I hate to sound like an Apple fanboy, but this is a brilliant <laughs> tablet. I've had the original, I've had number two, and I've got the latest one. I'm just, you know, they're all so good. Mm. But I will say this, for anyone sitting at home who's thinking, oh, but there's a, there's a successor to this, the iPad 3 or the new iPad, anyone who asks me, I say, you don't necessarily need that. Mm. Yes, it's got a better screen, it's got better graphics, but in terms of what you want out of a tablet, browsing the web, looking at email, playing games, playing applications, yeah. you're not losing anything by having an iPad 2 and you save yourself some pennies, unless you're a discerning pennies pixel and finder. Pounds. It, pennies and pounds, it's yeah. very important. Unless you're, unless you're a discerning pixel finder, mm. you don't want to spot any pixels. I, don't, I think an iPad 2 is probably the best value for money product you can get out of the iPad range. Well, I have the iPad 2 and I have seen the latest iPad. It is brilliant, of course it is, but mm -hmm. I have no desire to upgrade. Exactly. I don't feel the need to whatsoever because it performs so, so brilliantly. By the way, look at those four interest-free easy payments. The first payment today of £82.25 and, and then the second payment 30 days later and so on after that. That is how easy payments work. My family is such a big fan of Apple. My daughter, mother half, went to the Apple store today and she brought me back this badge. <laughs> I just show you this little badge from the that. Apple Store today. Have you seen this? I have it's a it. mini iPhone oh, that is so with a union cute. flag. <laughs> In fact, she brought home about five. Oh, I want one. I'm going one. to the Apple Store tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> it's not a real one, but I said to show it on air. Anyway, <laughs> three, two, nine, the price on this, on those maximum easy payments of eighty-two pounds and twenty-five pence. I could have FaceTimed her on air, couldn't I? You could oh, have. Oh, next time. And it would have been very, very, very quick. We FaceTime just before the show, and the brilliant thing about FaceTime is it's like being at home without being at home because it's a window <laughs> into your home. In fact, recently I FaceTimed Ralph of Honora Pearls in America from QVC. That is how good it is. OK, stay with us. A whole hour of technology with Apple, with me, Lucy, and you continues after this.
QVC understands the importance of offering customers a complete technical support service. A real person at the end of a phone that can help you with anything technical. Talking you through setting up and operating all technical products. We call it TMTI. Talk me through it. From how to wire a plug to setting up a home computer network. For this great value service, please go to qvcuk.com for more details. TMTI. Talk me through it. That's what we do. I've always wanted to have my own jewellery range and I'm so excited, it's like a dream come true. What I love about Diamondique is it's got all the glamour and sparkle of diamonds, but it's affordable. Everyone can have Diamondique. Everything is based around what I already wear and it makes it easy to go from daytime into evening without going through the hassle of changing your jewellery. Join me, Andrea McLean, as I launch my own jewellery collection only on QVC. Well, of loose women fame, I'm here with Andrea McLean this evening at 11. <laughs> I know she's working with me. <laughs> she wouldn't have agreed to that, actually. <laughs> anyway, and that kickstarts our amazing Diamonic Day, which then continues with Alison Young at midnight tonight. But this hour is technology with Apple, and Lucy Hedges is my special guest. Lucy, it's great to have you here. It's uh, we're good both to be very here. much on the same hymn sheet when we talk about how much we love the aesthetics, the technology, the build quality of Apple, which you can experience with QVC this evening. Delivery charge, no, that's all included, which is great. And we've got those easy payments for you as well. This is stunning as well. 502124, the Apple MacBook Air 11-inch Intel Core i5 laptop with 2 gig of RAM, 64 gig of flash storage. We'll explain exactly what that means in a few moments. But before we do, can we just look at this? <laughs> can oh, yes. we just admire Let's the build look of this? At this. Wow. Way How for gorgeous thin. is that? Yes. And I know people at home can't feel this, but it is incredibly light to the point where I can hold it. Mm. in one corner and just lift it like that. There's no bend, there's no give, it's very solid and robust. Yeah. And it's gorgeous. It this really is probably is. one of the most coveted laptop, um, laptops on the planet. Yeah. And this bottom plinth, if you like, in which mm -hmm. those keys rest, that's made out of a single block of aluminium, isn't it? Yes, this, in, this entire body is called an aluminium unibody. And I remember when this term first came out in the tech industry and we were all a bit like, that sounds horrible, a unibody, but we now we, we're seeing Apple's vision. And just to show you again, look at that. It's just one solid piece of aluminium. It looks good. It's incredibly lightweight. It mm. tapers to very, very thin at the front and thick enough at the back so it's able to house your connectivity because that's very important for laptop users. But the one thing I will stress about this laptop, do not be fooled by its small size. Mm. Small size for a lot of people connotes netbooks, low-powered laptops, but this is beautiful performs well and does not compromise performance for the sake of portability. OK, let's run through that technology. Let's start with the details at the top. Well, the 11-inch screen size, Intel Core i5, that's the processor. And then, of course, we have the 2 gig of RAM. Combine the two and it works quickly, efficiently for you. Then we come down to this, which is really important, 64 gig of flash memory. Now, flash memory, that being a solid-state drive. Is that right, Lucy? Yes, solid-state drive. So what that means is there's no moving parts. It's going to be a lot quieter in use. It's not as power hungry so it's mm. saving you battery life as well so it's all beneficial it's all tick 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 in the plus side for having ssd and let's say you are a little bit clumsy some of us are some of us aren't mm. it means if you drop something like this um the parts aren't, are less likely to move around there's no moving parts in fact yeah so you're not gonna have you're not gonna be shaking it going oh my good god is that my hard drive in there <laughs> yes. you know it's ssd no moving parts and i think it's for the greater good that is in this laptop and it means you're gonna get it helps you have a battery life of around six to seven hours and also being flash memory it makes yes. it Fast. Exactly, and that's what we all want at the end of the day. Yes. We want to flit in and out of different things, we want to save stuff, we maybe want to edit video, and we want to be able to do so working with something that can back up how quickly you're moving, and that's what this is about. And this screen here is just 4.86 millimetres thick. There's a camera at the top there as well, mm -hmm. so we can 
do our FaceTime, we can FaceTime. do our web chats. What else can we do on here? What's on the screen when we get this home? Um, okay, when you get this home, let's just come out of this. Now, it's okay. a bit, because I'm a bit of an odd angle, so I might not do this justice, but it's running something called OSX Lion. Now, this is, until recently, it was the latest operating system. Now we've got OSX Mountain Lion, but the great news is you can update that for about £20. That's the great thing about the operating systems with Macs and uh, with Apple even. Everything is affordable and Apple wants everyone to move forward mm. with them, not be left in the past. So it's future-proof, basically. So the great thing about OSX Lion, I don't know if anyone just saw what I just did just then, so using this glass trackpad, I can obviously navigate around as I would, but let's say I want to look at all my open applications, three finger swipe, and that gives me what's called a uh, mission panel, no, actually, control panel. <laughs> <laughs> mission control, something like that. Either way, names are relevant. It brings up everything that you're using yeah. to enable you to multitask really quickly. Did you say glass trackpad? Glass trackpad. With that three finger yes, swipe. Yes, exactly. Wow. Which means it's ultra responsive. When I'm moving the cursor around, it's incredibly quick. If I'm doing another move, for example, I'm swiping between uh, all the applications I've got. Look at that, very yeah. effortless. It doesn't take much. And then again, if I want to bring up all the stuff I've got open, there it is again. And that's OSX Lion, so it's bringing a range of multi-touch gestures, which you learn over time. You're not going to get them straight out of the box, but that's part of the fun. But we can use this as a conventional trackpad as well. Absolutely. So we navigate Absolutely. to cursor on the screen. Exactly. Because so, I've never used the MacBook Air before. Okay. This is new to me. And so even if it's new to you, if you're used to your traditional trackpad, yeah. you'll pick up different gestures along yes. the way. And there's something that we're all quite familiar with, and that's pinch, and, pinch to zoom. So let's say you're on a website, for example, we pinch to zoom. Now that's not, you know, this isn't unique to the uh, MacBook Air, yeah. but it's something that will get people started. You think, oh, what so do I do with responsive. that? It's so responsive. What do it's I do though you're that? touching what you're seeing on the screen there. That is how responsive this technology is. 502124 is the item number, delivered in a matter of days. You've got those three interest free easy payments of £283. Maybe you're heading to university. Maybe you know somebody who does. And I know that Mac is very popular among university goers. Yes. I wouldn't know. I, I never went to university. <laughs> yes. Nobody would take me. But the University of Life was there for me. <laughs> and it hasn't served me that well. <laughs> but I know it's very popular among the mature students, 18, 19, 20 year olds, going to university. So this may be what you're looking for. Maybe those easy payments make it perhaps that little bit more accessible for you as well. 283 the price. So Intel Core i5 processor, 2 gig of RAM, 64 gig of storage. It has Wi-Fi, it has yes. Bluetooth, so we can go online uh, with our Wi-Fi connection at home. You can go online with your Wi-Fi connection. It doesn't have an Ethernet cable, so you can't plug into the wall. But I don't know a lot of people, any, I don't, in fact, I don't know anybody that really does that anymore, mm. except offices. But people on the move, people with the laptops and yes. uh, iPads, tablets at home, a lot of people are using Wi-Fi. So Apple's made the decision to scrap that. They don't need that. People don't need that. And it's also, as you'll notice, <laughs> There's no optical drive. Now, in order to keep the weight down, in order to keep that girth small, there's no optical drive. But again, that's not a big problem because what we've got here is the App Store. So just like we've seen on the iPad, on yeah. the iPhone, on multiple Apple devices, you've got access to a multitude of programs. So you don't necessarily need that CD drive. And for anyone who wants to maybe get a bit geeky who didn't know, you can actually um, connect to a computer's CD drive wirelessly with some software. So if you are thinking, oh, I really like this, but mm. I want an optical drive, that option is out there for you with additional software if you want to take it. And I noticed on the screen a few moments ago that photo of me you took with the iPad about 10 or 15 minutes ago. Oh, yes. Which appeared on here, and that's via the iCloud. Yep, via iCloud using something called Photo Stream. Yeah. So there we go. I promised we'd come back to this. I've taken it on the iPad. We're connected <laughs> over, we're connected to Wi-Fi, and a few minutes later, as it's refreshing the system, it pulls in everything that you've taken on each device and marries them all together. It's so brilliant. It's fantastic. We have a firewire port on there, don't we? Yeah. Ooh, we've got uh, two USBs. We've also got Thunderbolt. Now, Thunderbolt, this is future-proofing this MacBook Air, so it's 10 times faster than USB 3.0, 20 times faster than USB 2.0. Gosh. So, you know, Apple's put the very latest technology into this, and they've developed it with Intel, and it's not something that's unique to Apple. It's something that loads of other manufacturers are jumping on board with as well. So the connectivity 
Firewire port, USB 2 and Thunderbolt, is that right? No Firewire. No, we've firewire. Got, no, no. We've got, um, the, some of the bigger models have Firewire, but we've got two, two USBs, Thunderbolt and your MagSafe um, charger connector. So when you're plugging Brilliant. in, it just connects automatically. Thank you, Lisa, for making that clear. All right, 502124 right. is your item number there. The Apple MacBook Air 11-inch Intel Core i5 laptop with 2 gig of RAM and so much more as well. Do take advantage of those easy payments. Now, this... You know, it is compact, it is very discreet in size, however, it delivers and offers so much. It is the Apple iPod Nano 16 gig MP3 player with FM radio, £129 the price on this here. And that is the QVC price, uh, PMP included, and delivered in a matter of days to you. And we're not just playing music, but we're going to view photos on here as well, if you want to, when you get the same. And also, built-in FM radio as well. Let's go through those colour choices that we have for you this evening. Here's the orange. It looks quite yellow on the front of that display, but it is orange, as you can see the casing there. So it's your orange colour. If you just look at the edge of the case, uh, then we go on to the graphite grey. From the graphite grey to our blue is your third choice. It might be easier if I just took them forward, then you can see the actual colour. And I love how the metallic, the metallic hue. Yeah. You can't necessarily tell, but they all have a very slight metallic hue. They're just really nice. There's the pink. Onto this is that empty your favorite, case here. The pink? That's the empty box. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's kind of houses there. these, yeah. <laughs> it's the silver, as you can see there for you. Uh, Gorgeous, beautifully made, as you can see. And then you've and then got finally. that fabulous green in your hand just there. OK, there, the colour choices. Discreet and really compact in size. What yes. can we do with this? More than play music. Grams. In fact, if you hold it in your hand for long enough, you probably won't even remember it's there. Yeah. But its size kind of says to you this is a great device for people who are into their fitness. Not necessarily. It could be for your commute in the morning. Maybe you don't want an oversized MP3 player. You've, you like your phone, you don't want to be bogged down with two things. Um, it's got a clip, so you can clip it to your lapel, clip it to your collar, clip it to your running yeah. jacket. There's so many uses for it. And you know, there's so many different members of the iPod family that something like this is for people who really don't want to be bogged down, weighted down with a music device. And what's great about it is they, they, they've brought the touchscreen technology of the iPad, the iPhone, to their gorgeous and cute little nano. So we've got these icons here which are familiar if you're an iPhone user, if you're an iPad user. We, we, these, these icons are familiar. So as you can see here, this is what it's designed for. It's your iPod. So there's your music, uh, broken up into playlists, artists, albums, songs. So if I go into an album, yeah. I've downloaded Be My Baby for a bit of old school music. And I can scroll through the different tracks when I've hit one that I like simply hit it, there's the album art. If I tap the screen, it just reminds me that it is playing. I can skip the track, I can pause it. It's all very clever. If I move over another screen, what you've got here is an uh, icon to shuffle your music. You've got uh, Apple's Genius. So when this is attached to your iTunes account, you have to plug it into your computer, you pick one track and it will create playlists based on the genre or based on the type of music that's in your iPod. So it does the work for you. You can create your own playlists if you yeah. want, but Apple will do it for you. So that's quite clever. Very what I clever. like, and a lot of people don't know this, yeah. you can rotate the screen using two fingers. So if I very, very effortlessly... Oh, that's neat. You know? And I think a lot of people might be thinking, oh, what's the point in that? Well, let me show you. <laughs> <laughs> Lucy, what's the point in that? Well, we have a <laughs> clock uh, feature here. Now, you can actually use the iPod Nano as a watch, if you want. You can buy some straps, if you want. I've seen those, and you've got lots of different clock faces exactly. you can choose from. So maybe someone wants to check out my watch, but it's facing me, you know? I can just turn it around and be like, yeah, check out my cool digital watch. <laughs> and on top of that, I can scroll through a multitude of different faces, so you're not just stuck with one design. Well, it's you all can very colour clever. coordinate. Exactly, colour coordinate your strap, or your outfit, or your hair. Away you go. It's a lot of fun, isn't it? £129, earphones included, 16 gig of storage, one and a half inch display, the FM radio on board as well. Amazing value for money when you think of the pedigree of the name, the pedigree of the technology. 502132 is your item number there for you. OK, this hour's going far too quickly for my liking. There's more on the way, including the iMac, which is coming up very shortly indeed. Don't miss another of Tuesday's Hot Picks. Look after your skin with help from the Ultrasun 100ml Face 30. Over 15,000 have been sold so far here on QVC. 
the non-greasy, water-resistant Factor 30 formula is suitable for all skin types and is free from perfume, emulsifiers and preservatives. Find out more during Ultrasun Professional Sun Care, Tuesday at 9pm. I'm absolutely delighted to be on QVC. I just see it as such a good way to reach so many people. There's no such thing as a typical Lulu Guinness customer. It's more about a spirit, people that enjoy carrying bags with a bit of personality. It was really nice to get my OBE because it meant I'd been recognised for my services to the fashion industry. I think the real unique thing about QVC is you get my bags, you can get my philosophy and you also get me. OK, this hour is going so, so quickly, but good times often do, don't they? It is an hour of technology featuring Apple. In other words, a whole hour featuring Apple here on QVC. Lucy Hedge is my special guest who lives, breathes and sleeps technology. Personally, a huge fan of Apple, as indeed I am. I was first introduced to Apple around 1995, 96 such an exciting time I've had both professionally and domestically with Apple. It is used professionally around the world. Yes. And we are now bringing something which is breathtaking <laughs> to look at because Apple, <laughs> it doesn't, doesn't just focus on what goes on inside, but also the outside is so important to them as exactly. well, isn't it? Exactly. And the iMac is just repeating what we've seen with the MacBook Air, the yeah. iPad, the iPhone. There's a real signature, isn't it's, there? Yeah, a signature look, the aesthetically beautiful technology inside a gorgeous shell. And that's exactly what this is. And as we've seen with the aluminium unibody, the creepily named aluminium unibody of the MacBook Air, we've got that same design at the back. Now, I won't flip this round because it's a bit heavy. <laughs> Not too heavy, but you know, isn't, this isn't designed to be pausable. It's an all in one for the home. Unlike those really ugly tower PCs or those big, you know, brick houses. Look at this. This is all that exists of the iMac. Well, there the is the back, as you can see there. Beautiful from every single direction. Exactly. There's no lines, there's no, no ugly screws. It's all just carved so beautifully, and the ports just sit in the back. And we have those interest for easy payments. £416.34 is your first easy payment there. OK, now we have the wireless keyboard. We have we that very intuitive mouse as well. But let's talk about the connectivity mm -hmm. on the outside. I've got the CD drive here, which is wafer thin, which just wafer takes that thin. CD on board for yeah, you. Yeah, we've got an optical drive and I'm playing, I was playing a movie. So will it play no. my CDs, it'll play my DVDs? It'll play CDs, it'll play DVDs, not Blu-ray uh, uh, DVDs, I'm afraid. But the positive of that is that you can download your own uh, Blu-ray quality movies onto its whopping one terabyte uh, hard drive. Which is a thousand a gig thousand in old gig. money. And the screen resolution is about as good as it gets. Isn't oh it? yes, this is, this is high res. You're talking high res display, great contrast, everything's punchy, everything's vibrant, it's true to colour. So we've got the QVC website, mm. got Mark Cavendish here, I was lucky enough to interview him. Look at the colours of the yeah. Team GB kit. Uh, we've got the iPad down here in a video. Look at the colour of the icons at the bottom. And what I will say, look at the uniform uh, operating system with the iPad, with the iPhone, with the Mac OS. Nothing's different. It's all similar. Now, obviously, the iPad and um, the iPhone, they have a smartphone and tablet-specific mm. operating system. But what Apple has done with OS X Lion, which is the operating system which you've seen on yeah. the MacBook Air, they're trying to marry together the the smartphone and the P and the oh, I nearly said PC then and the computing experience yeah. to give you just that that seamless experience that's going to enable you to move in and out of your uh, devices and just to reiterate again what we saw on the MacBook Air yes. I'm going into iPhoto and lo and behold there's your photo <laughs> so it's gone onto the iMac it's gone onto the MacBook Air it's gone onto the iPhone which you saw earlier. It's so clever. And what have we done? Nothing. All it's we've done is set it up. astonishing. So you took a photo earlier on the iPad, which we'll probably come back to a bit later in the show. And then, via iCloud, it's appeared on our other iCloud-enabled devices that we set up, and that being the iMac, yeah. the iPhone, and the MacBook Air. Exactly. Effortless. And I hate to use this word, but it's something we say a but lot. But you can use it anyway. It, I am. <laughs> it's an ecosystem, you know? It's the Apple ecosystem. <laughs> yes. And everything just works so well with each other that 
you'd be you'd almost be silly to not buy into the, the family, so to speak. Yeah. You know, everything works so intuitively together that that's and that's what Apple's famous for. That's what Apple. Uh, is really known for. Well, there's your specification. 2.7 gig Intel quad-core i5 processor, 4 gig of RAM, uh, 1,000 gig of storage, in other words, 1 terabyte, so it's going to store very happily movies, video, music, photos. You've got the wireless keyboard and the magic mouse as well, quite like no other mouse I've come across before. 21 and a half inch incredible screen resolution monitor which houses all of that technology and actually Even, that's even with a DVD inside. Gosh. So, yeah, it's very quiet. Now, you just touched on the magic mouse. Now, a lot of people were just used to your traditional bog-standard mouse, two uh, buttons on the right and left and a scroll wheel. Now, this takes on a completely different look. From the side, you can see that it's quite ergonomic, so, you know, it um, sits in the palm quite nicely. But as we've seen on the MacBook Air, it's running an operating system that lends itself to gestures. So we don't have the trackpad, but what we've got is this. Now, I've got to lay it flat to show you. But So we've got the three-finger swipe. Oh, I can swipe between applications, and that's using, that's using the mouse. As you can see, yeah. um, I can scroll upwards, and that should. Oh, this is what happens when you have slightly sweaty palms. Okay. <laughs> so I'm not <laughs> going to show you that, but basically, this is almost replicating what a trackpad can do for you, but yeah. in a mouse form. Now, Steve Jobs, uh, as much as he likes, as much as he likes to uh, take technology forward, he did say that the mouse is the one thing that has always been. Uh, connected to a computer you can't do without it. So what mm. they've done is just variated it. They've just updated it and put that Apple print on it and made it unique to them. And Let's it's talk really about nice. The connectivity on mm -hmm. here as well. We talked about the optical drive around yes. the side here. Is this a card reader that I'm seeing here as well? We've Lucy? got a card reader. So you're taking photos, quickly take it out of your camera, whack it into the SD card slot. You can use iPhoto. It yeah. will then beam them over to your other devices yes. and things like that. You can edit them, because that's what iPhoto does as well. You can even put them in iMovie, which is what this is, dedicated um, editing, photo editing and movie editing software, which is free, by the way. Um, so that comes pre-installed? Comes pre-installed. That's the iPhoto, that's iMovie, and something called GarageBand, which is, for all the musical people out there, mm. it's just a great way to... Um, Create your own music. It's like having your own recording studio built into your very yeah. gorgeous iMac. And you can uh, record singing, you can record guitar strums, you can record uh, keyboards. You can even get lessons online from the likes of Sting and some other famous uh, musicians who will teach you online. John Legend, look at that, Nora Jones, how to play. Yeah. Um, your, your instrument. So it's very, it really and this comes as is standard. Remarkable technology. There's the QV surprise at 1249 and 2 pence. However, PMP is included, so there is no separate charge for delivery, but we have those interest free easy payments, £416.34, and, and this is with you in a matter of days. And remember, as I mentioned earlier, with every product here at QVC, from food to jewellery to technology, you always have that peace of mind. So you can be certain of every purchase of that 30-day money-back guarantee. We want you to be happy with every single order. But this is the brand, this is the name which has excelled in technology, which has developed and pioneered technology time and time again. This is the brand which many other brands and manufacturers look to to be inspired by. This is Apple on QVC this evening, only for another 10 or 11 minutes. We are back with the iPad 2 in a few minutes, but this aesthetically is beautiful. It is such a clean, crisp, minimal design, but it is packed it's with a, technology. It's a multimedia powerhouse. Yeah. We use these in the office. It's, it, you know, that's how good they are. They're great so you for, use this professionally? Yeah, they're great for graphic designers. We edit a lot of magazine pages using a program called InDesign. We need a computer that's able to keep up. It's quick, offers yeah. us the graphics we want, the type of t uh, fonts that we need to use. And it's not just for professionals. Take it home, edit your own movies that you've taken on your iPhone or your iPad, edit your own photos, go yeah. online, email, mess around with photos in photo booth. The possibilities are endless. And on top of that, it's in a gorgeous package. There are many all-in-one PCs out there, but this mm. is unrivaled in the looks department. And it's number one in the stuff top ten computers. <laughs> <laughs> we like the sound of that. 502-121 is your item number. 
phenomenal technology this whole hour has brought you here on QVC. 502121, item number, and to order yours, 0800 50 40 30. Q-Cut, of course, is there on 0800 52 42 32 with your membership number and PIN number. OK, now we're towards the end of the hour. We're going to finish the show how we started. It is with the iPad 2. OK, this has proven to be very, very popular in the show so far. Already two-thirds of the entire stock, I've just been told, has gone on this. So do bear that in mind. It is delivered with no charge added, so PMP is included. You've got those maximum easy payments as well. Never really been a better time to get the iPad 2 from QBC. So there is no PMP charge. £82.25 is your first easy payment. And this is with you in a matter of days. It is the stunning Apple iPad 2, 16 gigabytes with Wi-Fi and front and rear cameras with a whole host of fun for you to have and functionality for you to have on board. 502127, whether you're making video clips, taking photos, making FaceTime calls as I do most days when I'm at work to my family at home to say goodnight to the kids, whether you're visiting YouTube to see the latest, craziest download video clip, uh, we all know Charlie Bit My Finger has had something like 145 million views now. <laughs> it's amazing. Uh, and then we can email on here, we can gain access to iTunes, or you may say I've got a bit of downtime. I'll catch up on the latest episode of EastEnders that I missed a few days ago. <laughs> Go to the BBC iPlayer brilliant and it can do so much more besides as well and I love just how responsive the screen is I love how easy it is to use I've it seen young children use the iPad easy. without any effort at all anybody can use this and talking of YouTube go on YouTube and you can see young children who put, put my parents to shame, that's for sure, but they're swiping away and what's really interesting about this is the parents then gave them a normal magazine and the child's going why is my finger not working? So they don't actually <laughs> can understand what they're using, but it's, in, it's intuitive enough for them to use it. Yes. Whether you're swiping through home screens, you want to look at some photos, even if you want to set up email, it's very, very simple. It will hold your hand and take you through it. There's a list of the different kind of email clients you can have, and it's just a case of entering your email address, your password, it will do the rest for you, and then it will bring all your emails into the email application there. It's all very clever. Mm. Browse the web. You can use it to uh, download iBooks. So just like we've seen on the Kindle, electronic reading, maybe you're reading a certain book, Fifty Shades of Grey, you don't want people to know you're reading it, <laughs> put it into your iPad, no one will know, it will just be hidden away in iBooks. It's a music player, it's your iPod, yes. it's a video player, so multimedia at your fingertips, literally. And what I love about this is just scrolling through the home pages. It's just so intuitive. And we're not saying for one moment this will replace your main PC. However, when I first received my iPad, I was excited, but I didn't realise just how much I would use it. And actually, I use my PC less because what do we use our computers mainly for? It could be email, it could be browsing various websites, it could be going to YouTube or the BBC iPlayer, or it could be having a bit of fun like we're seeing here on this. Many of what we, or much of what we do on the computer, you can now do on this. But the difference being, this is really portable, isn't it? Exactly. And so lightweight as well. And look how skinny that is as well. Yeah. Not going to make your wrists. Uh, feel bogged down and weighted down. If you're holding it, maybe on a commute, you're sitting down with it on your lap. It's not going to burn your. It's not going to burn your legs. Doesn't overheat. It's not going to strain your wrists. It's just an all-rounder. Whether you're holding up to watch a video. Yes. Maybe you want to do some typing. Let's go and have a look at the keyboard. So we've got notes here. Just allows you to take some brief notes. I use this all the time when I forget something or I don't want to forget something. I write it down. Simple tap of the screen. That pulls up the keyboard, quite spacious, allows you to t type with two hands quite comfortably, turn it to landscape, it's even wider, giving you just a better scope to uh, get those words typed in. It is a beautiful piece of technology. It is simple and easy to use. Does it come with a manual, which is this thick? It or does this thick, not. Or this thick? It's <laughs> so thin, yeah, you may as well not even read it. What I would recommend to anyone buying this is turn it on. It's got battery. You're going to get at least 90% battery out of the box. Have a swipe, have a feel, just fondle it. 
get finger friendly with it, tap these application icons. Now, for people who don't, who aren't very familiar with an iPad, yes. everything that you're seeing that we've shown you on the home screen isn't going to come as standard. You get photos, you get your iPad, iPod, you get contacts, you get notes. But if you want games, if you want maps, if you want weather-related stuff, maybe fitness applications, yeah. maybe health applications, you need to go to the App Store and download that yourself. And the App Store, your sport for choice, you're looking at around 500,000, yeah, 500,000 applications. Plus I am listening to you, honestly, I know but you I'm are. having I'm a lot of fun not to laugh while I'm at the talking same while time you do as that. well. It is brilliant. And FaceTime, I just love. There, of course, is YouTube, so we can go online and see that clip of Charlie Bit My Finger <laughs> again. There are so many amazing <laughs> clips on YouTube uh, that you'll relive and enjoy time and time and time again. And look, some of those favourites are coming up right now. We look at the history on there, too. Uh, there is so much you can do on board here. Exactly. Download games. Visit the email. We've got the Canada up here. Messages is fun, isn't it? Messages. And again, like we've seen with iCloud, so we can uh, beam photos, transfer photos on one device to another device wirelessly. Yes. The same can happen with messages. If everything's on the same account, the same uh, network, if someone's sending you a message to your iPhone, it could pop up in your iPad, in your iMac. It's yes. all very clever. We've got notifications that come down on the home screen, and that's where it collects all your calendar notifications, maybe reminders, maybe like me, you're an avid eBayer. It yeah. will give me my notifications to tell me, you've got five minutes to bid on this dress. <laughs> hurry, hurry. <laughs> <laughs> We're well, busy on the phone lines for this. Do take a look at those maximum easy payments. Three quarters of the stock has now gone. That first payment of £82.25. and pence. That first payment, and this is with you in a matter of days for you to experience it is the apple ipad 2 16 gig with wi-fi and front and rear cameras there's the price this is how easy it is to use your ipad try this and experience this amazing piece of technology we just love it, it we is just really and i just want to show you just one quick thing before okay. We end this brilliant hour. A lot of people are unaware that you can turn these uh, different icons into folders. So if you want to group all your games, you've got maybe Angry Birds, Cut the Rope, all these firm favourites in the App Store, you can just hold down. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to merge BBC News with Travel Deluxe. Ah. And they turn, it turns into a folder. I can then name that folder, Did whatever you know I that? want. Yeah. And then tap the screen. Maybe hit the home button again so it stops again, the ability to delete, delete stuff. Go into the yes. folder and there we go. It's just a great way to tidy your home page. And speaking of YouTube, maybe we should round off with this YouTube clip of QVC and some of our bloopers, <laughs> including <laughs> Alison Young. Just found this on YouTube from many, many years ago. I do love the QVC blooper. It's amazing. It's had many, many, many hits. OK, that's the show. Draw to a close. You can watch the show back on Sky. Press red and follow those on-screen prompts or visit our website, qvcuk.com. Maximum easy payments. Thank you, Lucy. Thank Take you. care. Bye for now. Bye-bye. Look at this for a fabulous bargain. Now, when you see the price tumbling from... £182 to just £99.96 for a solid silver, sterling silver bangle like this. That is amazing. Seven centimetres across, 21 centimetres circumference, and a really dependable, beautiful weight that really says this should have cost an awful lot more. Now, we've reduced the price massively. It's nearly half price. We've got the maximum number of easy payments Sally looks beautiful, a classic look. Simplicity, the big chunky bangle, the black dress. Oh, Sally, that's gorgeous. This is fab, isn't it? Isn't it? I mean, we've seen lots of bangles. We've seen brass, we've seen wood, we've seen all mm. sorts of acrylics and things like that, but solid sterling silver. The shine, the sparkle, it's absolutely stunning. And you'd expect to spend a lot more than that on a lot smaller bangle, but that is phenomenal. Mm. Wow. Imagine what you'll look like when you're wearing it. Now, you can try this on in the comfort of your own home. You can see if it's too chunky for you, if it really looks the part, if it's going to go with other things, if you like it, will it fit over your hand? All those things because you've got a 30-day money-back guarantee. That hammered finish is beautiful because it sparkles the light no matter which angle the light is at. And also because it's hammered, it gives it that kind of slightly more protected feel. If it was highly polished and smooth, it would show up every single scratch.
By the way, the scratch is very resistant to scratching because it's rhodium plated. But the thing is about this, it's got this weight. It's a really lovely feel. Not too heavy to be sort of thing that you don't want to wear because it's too chunky, but heavy enough that you know you're wearing solid sterling silver. We have got incredible prices on our jewellery. To see any reduction is always great, but to see something that's been slashed nearly half price, and then the maximum number of easy payments spreading the cost, this is an opportunity that's too good to pass up. 603-584 is tonight's bargain hunter number. Now, we won't be talking about it again. There's only a certain amount of stock in, in the warehouse, and once it's gone, it's gone. So get your orders in quickly. And I know it's busy on the phone lines, so uh, grab your uh, iPad or your iPhone or your Android phone.